everyone, Joel Lance here, and today we are at P&M Orange Street Market, guys. Yes, P&M Fine Foods Orange Street Market here in New Haven, Connecticut. My first time actually in Connecticut and going to attempt my first food challenge in Connecticut today. So today we're eating a six foot, yes, a six foot submarine sandwich, guys. This is the biggest sandwich I've ever, ever, ever seen in my life. The bread itself is just giant. Not to mention that we're gonna be filled with all kinds of different toppings. Um, you can take the submarine sandwich like and do it in different flavors, so I probably will. You know, maybe like two, three, four. I'm eating this today with my friend, Mr. Scott. So now this submarine sandwich, they say they weigh between 15 and like 18 to 20 pounds like depending on what you get so this is absolutely insane guys so we're talking an absolutely giant 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 submarine sandwich but it sounds really good should be like a lot a lot of fun so this place is really really cool uh, it is not only offers like you know like a restaurant like cooks you know for your lunch dinner um, They're really well known for their chicken parms also their submarine sandwiches all kinds of other different items But you can literally buy your milk and bread. They have a fresh butcher like they have a butcher in here like uh, everything It's really really cool. So like I said they offer a lot of stuff very unique location um, this is one of the two They have this uh, New Haven location this one in Brantford, um, but yeah, so that's pretty much it um, I think we're gonna have 40 five minutes to complete the challenge and double check that um, and the value of the sandwich is upwards of about two hundred dollars so definitely a lot of food guys we got big steaks we have completely bringing meal for free so let's head on in let's have some fun and eat some food and ultimately let's go all right everyone so here we are with the submarine sandwich guys this is absolutely giant so scott this thing is as big as we are. I know, it's like six feet at least. It was absolutely huge. So it looks really, really good though, guys. We have the bread being made fresh. Of course, all the delicious quality ingredients. We did go with four different flavors. So we have this lovely quarter here, which is a mozzarella. It is an olive oil, tomato, chicken cutlet. Uh, kind of a really, you know, delicious kind of Neapolitan uh, flair to that. We then have the chicken club. We're talking lettuce, tomato, bacon, mayonnaise. We also have the chipotle sauce on here as well as we have the cheese. We have the Italian special. We're talking pepperoni, capicola, salami, all those good things. With some banana peppers, add a little bit of spice, a little bit of acidity. And over here we have the American combo. So we're talking like roast beef, we have ham, we have uh, like again the roast beef they do in house, which looks really delicious. And um, yeah, so all those good things. Um, but that's about that. So uh, how about we get started here just momentarily? Scott, you ready to eat? Oh yeah. For right. sure. So, Always when in Connecticut. Yeah, we just, by the way, this is actually our first food challenge attempt in Connecticut. This is both of our first time being in Connecticut. So pretty dang cool. Um, I do have a knife, obviously. We will definitely cut this up. Uh, and preferably so we get like, you know, a little bit of taste of each. So I don't know, we'll start. I don't know, let's in the center there. Yeah, I'll start kind of in the center. Try to like I said, try to divvy this up. This is a huge, huge, huge submarine sandwich. That is definitely for sure. I'll just kind of do a few quick cuts here. We can always keep getting more cuts as we kind of go on. But anyway, nonetheless, here we are. So there we go. We got a we got a cut of the, the Italian and the club or the BLT to start. Okay. Good with that? I'm good with that. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, I might as well cut it off. Yeah. Let's just get at it. Might as well do it while we're at it. Okay. Uh, probably right there. Ish. Alright, so. Ready to get started, Scotty boy? Absolutely. Okay, well, how about we start? We'll save the count of. Five. Four, three, two. Ooh, we, these are huge. They are. That is, that is a giant. I know. Right. How's that look, right? How about <laughs> one? Ready to start? Absolutely. Let's All do right, it. Let's eat. Here we go. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. This is a big sub. Mm hmm. Tastes good though. Absolutely, very flavorful. Mm. Chicken cutlets, nicely cooked. Very beautifully seasoned. Known for their cutlets, 
which says something a lot if you're familiar with the area. That is some hearty bun right there. About six inches wide, the, the bun there. Hearty is right where. Hey everyone, welcome to this video where today we are here in New Haven, Connecticut at p and Orange Market doing an absolutely massive, yes, the biggest submarine sandwich or the biggest sandwich in general that I have ever, ever seen. So this thing was seriously sitting at six plus feet long and it was heavy. It was so heavy. It was so dense. There were so many ingredients on it. I gotta say, the way they top these sandwiches was just out of this world. They put so many products on there. There was so much meat. You like were getting such an amazing value and everything was a super high quality. It was either being made in house or coming from the highest of producers and manufacturers. So when it came to the flavors, we had the four different, uh, such as like a chicken club, we had the all-American. Basically, we had kind of covered what I would describe more like traditional deli cuts, traditional deli sandwich, I guess you could say, and then kind of a more, um, I'll say a little more elaborate uh, kind of sandwich, I guess. Um, essentially, it was delicious. I'll just put it that way. But I tell you, that bread was thick. It was big, it was thick, and this thing was made to feed many, many people. Great flavors on this. I really tell you using the quality product. Not just the bread, but the meat as well. So traditionally, of course, these sandwiches would be served for like, you know, a sports team or maybe you're having a big meeting. I mean, like this thing would feed, again, so many people. Um, however, of course, there was just two of us today. Of course, the store also had more than just the sandwiches. Oh, not only again did they have the deli, but they also had a full market. They sold like fresh meats, they sold produce, but then they also had a lot of cooked items, like hot items, such as pastas or like chicken parms, um, veal cutlets, really kind of that nice Italian flair um, in all the cuisine. So this bread was made fresh, obviously, locally. They've got two local places that they get their fresh bread from. So this was specially made for this challenge here. And normally people feel like a whole football team with this. Somehow we decided to do it. And we're about almost four minutes in. If you've never been to Connecticut, I will definitely say it is a very, very beautiful place. This was an excellent neighborhood. I mean, it is known for prestigious universities. It is uh, actually known for pizza. The area is definitely well known for pizza, but it is just well kept. It is old, it is gorgeous. Some great American history and culture here on the East Coast in New Haven or, you know, Heaven, new heaven, um, essentially. But yeah, it was really cool. Like I said, great place. The staff were super, super friendly. Of course, I'm always a big fan of supporting you know small local businesses, and that's what these guys at the market do as well. Um, not only having you know things like local sodas, but again, pulling on those local meats, pulling on the local produce, like everything they can, you know, and, and exhibiting a lot of really unique products. But I want to believe that's most of the information. So maybe we'll tune on in in a little bit. Um, but at that right. Now comment your favorite kind of sandwich down below. Yes, comment your favorite sandwich down below and let's see what happens. All right, hop over this chicken flag. This is the one with the parm on it, mozzarella, olive oil, tomato. Oh, great flavor on that cutlet. Beautiful little spot outside outside the uh, cafe here, so it's a great place to enjoy the day. 
Have some food with a friend. Lunch. Beautiful neighborhood as well. Kind of close to Yale. Lovely day. About eight and a half minutes in. Again, very good sandwich. Flag's really nice. Got two more to go. It's got to really well. We just got to keep it up. Definitely getting a nice jaw workout. Like I said, it's definitely quality bread. But uh, yeah, no complaints. So this is the Italian here, very delicious. It's got that nice balsamic on top of the uh, three uh, meat combo there. So it's got a uh, capicoli, I believe, and a ham and a salami as well. So very delicious. All right, here I got the giant, 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 giant. Chicken club, lots of ingredients on this, so lots of bacon and everything else, so I'm in for a treat, but man, these are thick. Thick, thick, thick Woo. subs. Oh, wow. Ooh, that chipotle on there? Mm-hmm. That is good. Ooh, that bacon. Woo! Here I have the lovely American, which is the biggest piece of the sub that I've ever seen. This is so, like, this is just, dude, this is like my head. Crazy. Woo. We are 14 minutes in. Killing it. Oh, this is good too, man. Yeah. Really good. There's no escape. Oh, they will. They will. Oh, there's something reminding of us. Okay, see when we get back. Definitely going to get in there. See you guys. That roast beef is awesome. They make that here. A little bit of mayonnaise, everything in there. Just a true classic, man. This is a, this is a sub. Very lively street, great place to eat. There's a ton of people around, great atmosphere. Awesome patio just to hang out and chill. 
about 18 minutes in or coming on 18 minutes. They also have Fox and Park guys, the local soda. Very delicious. I had a white birch beer. Very delicious. I just, say, I just keep saying delicious, but mm -hmm. it's the best way to describe it. The boss wanted too, that's how good it is. Yeah. Almost 21 minutes into subs and chill, guys. Very, very delicious. Very good. They said it's a lovely fall day. Drink lots of cold beverages. I'm cooling off a bit, but it's very pleasant here, man. Like, what a, what a nice neighborhood. Mm. My camera just shut off for some reason. It says overheated. I guess maybe because it's in the sun. So I'll have to leave that for a minute, but keep on, keep on trucking. Not the truth. <clears throat> Joel wants to give me five minutes to catch up to him. Uh -huh. So he's always thinking about me. It's really nice. Right. All right, done the last quarter. This guy's also, so we're coming in to win there, guys. We're coming in for the finish, I should say. I love this club, it's very good. Alrighty, we're getting on our way. We and Scott well on our last pieces, guys. We're coming in for that finish. Definitely a big sandwich. I still love this chicken club. I think it's my favorite out of the combo. Got a favorite so far? Mm-hmm. I'd say the chicken club as well. I definitely say the chicken club as well. Uh, very good cutlets, very beautifully seasoned. Uh, the bacon was nice, a little topping on top there. Uh, the tomatoes, the cheese, uh, everything was very delicious. And I think it had some balsamic on there as well. Was that uh, chipotle? Chipotle, but it had the um, a little bit of uh, overlap, I think, from the other sandwich. So very delicious. 
club. Beautiful. Oh. I don't want to quit the game. Excuse me. I just want to keep on playing. Just take a club of beef and put it on some fresh bread. That means compliments to the, the chef, head. or in this case, the. And there he sat, marking his cards with his piece of finger. Sandwich maker? He lost. I guess we would call it cook. And that's what we All right, the end is near for both of us. Doing real well. Scott's finished just down to some bread. I said a few scraps. We're getting it done. You guys are miracle workers. Save some crumbs for the birds. They'll love you for it. Sharing, sharing the life. There's already crumbs down. Sharing is care. Yeah. You all got a bird. Thank you. Beautiful to witness. This Fox and Park is really good. Giant white birch, that's what that is. Birch beer. Love it. We're getting the sun track in. You can tell I've been here for a while. They're hot. A little warmer though. All right, guys, really coming down to the last bite. Very delicious sub. I really enjoyed it. Scott's just literally down to a bite left, and uh, that's about it. Excuse me. Finished. All right, everyone, so just finished up. That was definitely, definitely, definitely a big sandwich. Scott, what'd you think, man? Oh, it was awesome. I enjoyed the experience. The sub was great. Um, the inside, you guys got to check out PM if you guys are ever, ever in Connecticut. Beautiful location out here, sunny day. All around great experience. So this is the New Haven location. I also one of Brantford's, so there is two, and I believe more to come. Um, but man, what a submarine sandwich. That was huge. That was well bigger than like any other sandwich I've ever seen in my life. I've seen some really big subs, but this one was just, it was dense, it was thick. It, you know, I think the word is hearty. Hearty, Scott, absolutely. Scott used that word yeah. earlier. It's definitely a hearty sub. I mean, that thing will fill you up. This could feed a lot of people. Today it fed two, but but it, trust me, it could feed a lot, lot, lot more. Um, Scott, do you have a favorite flavor? I think I like the chicken club. Chicken club was beautifully seasoned. I had those chicken cutlets, uh, the beautifully topped bacon and cheese and tomatoes. So and the uh, chipotle mayo as well. Yeah, oh that was a great so, addition. So uh, yeah, it was. I think that was mine. What about you? I have to agree. I, I think the club was def like the club is uh, definitely a must try for me. Again, I just love that bacon mayo kind of uh, chicken combo. 
I also really actually liked the uh, like the American, the American kind That's of classic. Right. That there. was that that was a hearty all around Huge. sandwich. I have never Those seen were, like a like a you know like a, a deli cold cut kind of sandwich oh. with that much meat on it. That yeah. was exceptional. And, and they didn't make it like you know especially big for us. It, like and the roast beef they make here that was really really delicious. You could really pick that up with the ham and everything. So thoroughly enjoyed it. Um, very very pleasantly flavored overall. I have no complaints. Um, so for that we do get the about 175 or 200 dollar uh, stuff for free, which is really really cool. Um, definitely kind of giving us our first win in Connecticut. Uh, like I said, guys, but yeah, it was really cool. I'm glad we got to be here. I'm glad we got to you know have this experience. P and M, like I said, definitely a really cool spot to check out. And it's interesting because, like I said, it's like it's a market, but then they have food. So like you can buy your bread and milk, and then you can grab yourself a chicken parm. Yeah, absolutely. I don't know. They said they're really, really good. We might have to maybe try one of those as well. Afterwards, yeah, yeah. Um, but that, everyone, that's about it. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Definitely, like I said, stop on by. And, uh, of course, till next time, say happy, healthy, hungry, happy eating. Definitely check out joeleats.com. Grab yourself some merch there. And uh, at that, everyone, just, just have a little day. I can't, uh, here, right, I'll come around. I can't uh, <laughs> do the normal. We're just sitting that far away. I can't do the normal whatever. So, oh, here, there's the, there's the belly. And then, everyone, until next time, have a lovely day. Alright guys, just finished the challenge here with our good friend Yossi. We've had lots of subscribers come by say hi today, but Yossi being one of our friends here. Yossi, any words, my friend? Oh, it was a great challenge. I'm surprised you were able to finish such a great sandwich. It was so hearty, and uh, you guys did it in re you know, record time. Thank glad I was here. Thanks, man. And how was it to see it live? Was it different live than on a video? It was amazing just being able to meet you guys and be out here and, and enjoy the, the nice area and just to see you guys do a, such a nice challenge. It's really a blessing. I'm, Happy to be here. Hey, dude. Well, I appreciate that. Thanks so much, Yossi. No and uh, that, everyone, like we said, Connecticut. It's been really pleasant, very beautiful area down here. And, uh, you know, kind of known for Yale. Known for Yale, like the university. So, anyway, that's about it, guys. And, you know, until next time. That's about it. Let's go, uh, we'll go find some dessert or something. No, yeah. just, it sounds really good. Should be, like, a lot, a lot of fun. This place is really cool because not only do they have a full kind of, like, hey, what's up? Thank you. That's cool. Some guys just did a drive by, said hello. Um, awesome. What was I saying? So this place is. All right, everybody, and we are driving in New Haven, Connecticut. Look at this. We have the water right there. I don't know if you can see that, but very, very, very beautiful. Oh, let's see. I can zoom in a little bit. You can't really see because the barrier. But anyway, yeah, very, very beautiful. Very, very gorgeous. Nice blue skies. It's a nice autumn kind of fall day. First time in Connecticut. Um, I'm gonna make a little glimpse of the water. But yeah, very stunning. I mean, of course, you know, they're kind of known a little bit for seafood and New Haven here is known for Yale, like the university. And uh, yeah, just all very pleasant. So it's cool. I approve. New Haven, Connecticut. Hey, guess what? You rock, yes, you rock. Thank you so much for watching the video. I totally appreciate it. I hope you left me a comment down below. I'd love to read them. I hope you also liked that video. Hey, by the way, click my face. You can subscribe. Yes, subscribe. That way you always get my uploads. You won't miss me when I'm in your town. And I also picked two videos for you. Yes, two videos I know you'll love right here. So watch one of those, hit my face. And with that, thank you so much, you rock.